Greetings. Greetings, Commodore Jeff Zambello. I'm very happy to see that they now have a high flow, both hot and cold water faucet instead of these water saving trickle down pieces of shit, cheap ass sinks. This one has only cold water, but moderate pressure. This one, this one here, forget it. Hard, the water hardly comes out, but this one is nice. It has both hot and cold water and good water pressure. I'm very happy to see this. All right, thank you. Okay, here we go, Royal Hibachi Buffet, Route 46 West, Satterbrook, New Jersey. I'm just, I just got here. I, I came out of the men's room and I am showing you the beautiful Turkish lamps in the party room. Isn't that lovely? They're all turned on. Somebody pissed me off in the men's room because he didn't bother to answer me when I offered him the high uh, volume water flow sink um, that had both hot and cold water. The old bastard didn't even bother to answer me. I felt like punching him right in the face. I really, ha I really felt like it. But anyway. Okay. Here we got some. No, that ain't tilapia, that's cod. I have a feeling that yeah, a guy wasn't too far away from me when I said that. I have a feeling I'm going to end up duking it out with somebody today. Anyway, it's raining out, so I, I had a feeling that the quality. that the quality of the fish was going to be outstanding because of the rain. Commodore Jeff Zambello and Exorcist Bishop Brian. Nice thick cod. Scribed cod. Look at that. Look at the thickness of it. Look at the thickness of it. Look at that, Bouya base, calamari, mussels, shrimp. Look at that, look at the beauty of that. All right, you got it? Okay, over here, we got the shrimp alfredo, and uh, barbecue lamb ribs, of course. Sacrificial lamb. Oh yes, a great, a great surf and turf. That guy, that, that guy's following me around. I think I'm gonna have to punch him right in the face. I'm really, really in not in a great mood, but I was in a great mood when I left the house. But not so much now because of his arrogance. Thank God I don't work with the general public anymore. I really got some crawdads, craw, crawfish themed, little cock cockle clams, shrimp in a Creole sauce, brown rice, mixed vegetables and chicken. Here's the chow mein foon noodles. Got baby bok choy. Uh, let's see. Oh, look what we have. Look what came back. Crab soup. Look at that, wonderful crab soup. Um, let's see. All right, let me take a walk over here. I'm telling you right now, I'm in no mood for any nonsense. If that, if, if that old geezer that got arrogant with me in the got arrogant with me in the in the men's room says anything to me I'm gonna knock his ass out okay here we got anyway I digress um, for the very best uh, in hot chicken wings for your uh, special sporting event uh, party at home we have wings to go 
This is mild chicken wings. Wings to go. Yes, you heard it right. To go. You can buy it in bulk for your sporting event party at your home, regardless what sporting event it is, at the Royal Hibachi Buffet, Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey. Okay, there we got the mild one. And then here we have, uh, we got the, the buffalo wings, which they're going to replace, you know, in sauce. That's how fast they're selling, folks. They're really, they're really going fast and they're excellent. Right, they're excellent. And uh, let's see, any papaya? No, but I see mango. Oh, cauliflower. Grilled cauliflower and squish squash. Squash, look at that. It's one of my favorite vegetables, cauliflower. This woman. Yeah, I'm not in a squash mood actually. Okay, there's the mango over there. Mm, papaya would be good. I'm gonna get some lemons for my squad card. Oh, look where they We got more Chernobyl radioactive uh, ice cream. Ice cream, we got this. Nice and full. You can tell all the fat kids are not here because they would have messed it up. Strawberry, rainbow, rainbow sorbet, sorbet. Orange sorbet, coffee ice cream, and vanilla. And there's and there's a waitress here that is she's dying to be on YouTube right now. The, the moon cake, my little moon cake. You don't want to be on YouTube? Moon cake? Okay, now I'm gonna get the lemons. But First, I need a steak knife. Last time, they didn't have any steak knife out. Nothing. Now they have it. I need my lemon bowl. Oh, look. New color. Dark blue. Oh, that's not too bad. The lemon should look good in here. Okay, little lemons. Oh, look where they put the lemons. Holy crap. Put the lemons right behind the pole. Ah, uh, did they put the lemons behind the pole because they know how much I love lemons? Was it done out of spite? Oh. One only knows, only the, the spirits in the astral world know the truth. Oh, that's not too bad. I thought it was right behind the pole. Here we got the we got mussels and oysters came out early. We got a new color, new color soup bowl, navy blue or midnight blue. It looks pretty good with, in contrast to the yellow of the lemons. The winds of November come early, Gordon Lightfoot. And then we got the, the oysters come early. The shucked oysters, Commodore Jeff Zambello. Oh, shucks. Oh, shucks. The shucked oysters are out. There we go. That should do it for my refreshing lemon water and my fish. That old geezer is going to get knocked out if he comes near me. So it takes. Okay, there we go. Okay. Here we go. Thick scrod cod, grilled cauliflower. Barbecued lamb ribs. 
and beautiful lemons in a new color soup bowl. Okay, this is James P. Madonna here at the Royal Hibachi Buffet, Route 46 West, Satterbrook, New Jersey. And I am going to get some delectable seafood delights now. I just want to show you that I'm a real person and not a fake, like the other fake profiles. Okay, now, of course I'm going to get some crab soup in honor of the crab people from the South Park episode from Comedy Central. Crab people, crab people. And also the crab episode from Danny DeVito's um, It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia. A very funny episode. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a little bed of chow mein fun rice noodle. All right. Okay. And then I'm gonna add the um, the mussels in a. Hey, how you doing? And mussels in a. Um, I guess it's a. I don't know, a lemon, olive oil, and herbs base sauce. On top of this. The rice noodles absorb the broth of the sea. Okay. Got some calamari in there. That'd be a good stage name. Mr. Carl E. Mari, right? And uh, this way the the ju the seafood broth doesn't drip on the floor. It gets absorbed by the noodles. I'm not talking to myself. It's, I see. I see. I see you it's, every week. It's, it's, yeah, it's my Facebook thing, YouTube, Facebook, whatever. So anyway, um, I learned my lesson the hard way when I didn't use noodles and rice, and the um, seafood broth dripped all over me and the floor. So, got to use your head. All right. Hey, Whiting's. Whiting's are good. want people to know I'm not talking to myself right? there we go the broth of the sea ah now they're putting out some good some hardcore uh, oh, shit. Some hardcore sushi all right It's time for crab soup. Don't we stir the bottom of any soup. There you go. Because all the good stuff flows to the bottom because of gravity. Right, now I'm going to get some New Zealand green lip mussels and some lemons. They're steamed, marinated, whatever. Uh, some jabronis. We put out a lot of mangoes, huh? No papayas, but mangoes. That's all right. All right. Okay, now we've got some nice New Zealand green lip mussels. The pink ones are female, from what I understand. And uh, the gray ones are the males. Looks rather obscene, right? It looks like a labia. 
Now you know why they call them green lip mussels. Very high in omega-3 fatty acids. Also very good for osteoarthritis. All right. Get some lemons because it's an excellent combination. Squeeze lemon juice on these things for an excellent flavor. It's the Royal Hibachi Buffet, Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey. This is James P. Madonna of Mega Life 21 and Progressive Discussions. Of course, there is a lot more to me than just progressive uh, populist politics. I go beyond that. I am very well rounded. Not that, not that I am overweight or like, you know, Chris Christie, you know, obese. I don't mean well rounded in terms of that. But, uh, Jeff Sambello, oh shucks. Look at all the shuck doises. Oh, shucks. That should do it. And then next I'll have dessert, which will consist of uh, mangoes and I scream. trip over that kid's chair. Jesus. Hope I don't trip over it. I better not. Alright, I'm on the tail end. Time for some mangoes and ice cream. They're nice and firm, too. They're not overripe. I don't take these because that's where the hairy seed is, you know? The hairy pit. Hear people asking customers how you doing. It's a funny custom in America. Do, do people really want to know how you're doing? Seriously, do they really want to know? I'm sorry, you want the mango? Yeah, okay. I wonder what these things are. I don't know if they are. I don't know what they are. They don't, they never tell you. I don't know if they're kumquats or low quats or high quats or medium sized quats. Now, should I get this uh, Chernobyl uh, blue? Um, I wonder what that is. Is it? It's made with natural blueberries. I know what that is. You know what? It's a little too blue for me. I could try it. Looks like somebody took a magic marker or a crayon and just made ice cream. That's cotton candy. Oh, is it radioactive? I don't know. I'm afraid. Maybe. Maybe it is blueberry. I don't know. Let me try it. I'll try it. If I die, I, I know where it comes from. All right. You know what? Try that, and then uh, you can always go with vanilla. But yeah. you know what? I don't know. I don't know what to do. Oh, yeah, but I, I use this for a reason.
kid was telling me about the um, ice cream scoopers, and I, don't, I have my own personal reason that I don't want to explain it to a young child. If it was an adult, I'd tell him, but you know. Actually, it's more effective to use the, the sharper teaspoon, to be honest with you, for, for cutting through the ice cream. Ice cream, ice cream, ice cream company. It's an utter delight. That would be my ice cream company if I started one. I would have a screaming Eskimo milking a cow in the at the Arctic Circle with ice cream coming out of its udder, and then my slogan would be, "It is an utter delight." So. One more shot. All right. All right. I'm out of your way. Uh, this is very, very blue looking. I don't know if it's full of radiation or not, but I'll try it. I'll taste it. Let's see if it's. Natural blueberry. It might be. What do you people think? Otherwise, this is it. <clears throat> Until next time, take care. Have an enjoyable weekend and week in early April. The Royal Hibachi Buffet it's definitely no April Fool's joke here in early April, 2019. This has been a Mega Life 21 production.